Hi there, I'm Lisa Frederich. I've been with Orange Business Services most of my career, over 25 years. I'm currently serving as the head of the America's Service Design Center. When I started in the late 90s, it was exciting, it was different, everything is changing, and it's that same way today. So I had friends that actually had worked for Orange and I knew a little bit about the company um, and they were very positive about the company, whether it was the learning culture, the kind of teamwork. Um, Orange does seem to be very much a caring company when I first had heard about them and it's been true my entire career. They're very much on developing employees, serving customers, being a socially conscious company, which is not a common thing, I think. So it was a really, interesting opportunity. Orange is great on trying to develop our own employees, right? And, and give you opportunities to train. You can do online training. There's tons of stuff. We have partnerships with external companies. We have internal trainings on technologies. We have vendor trainings. And I think a big one for me is really engaging with the people that might be doing it right? You can take an online course, you can attend a vendor course, and then you talk to somebody that might be interested in it or already supporting it to really round out your experience. Um, I think the other thing is that the company does do external courses as well, right? So they invest in, in, in our staff. I was recently just at a course and I'm sure that was not cheap, um, but the fact that the company is willing to invest in us to develop us, I think is a key thing. And if you want it, you have to just go for it. There's lots of things you can learn online, on your own, approach your management, approach your peers, and you can really go anywhere you want. And the company actually has another focus on empowerment, right? And I really believe that that's important. Once you have people that are technically skilled and understand what they need to do, it is really having the empowerment to push that envelope, to develop something that maybe hasn't been done before, um, to pr propose a new service, a new way of working, a new thing. And I think that that's really what we as managers need to, to do for our employees. I have a team of people that I work with and really one of the main things that we're trying to do is to look at things differently, especially when you talk about um, services for our customers, right? Every customer is different. So you really have to think about what the customer requirement is, what the company can provide or what the technology can provide, and then how we can personalize it and customize it to, to meet that customer need. And I think that that is something we do on a daily basis. My personal value, as well as I think the value for the company is that we really have a team of people that are willing to work together, to work hard, to find solutions, but also that enjoy doing it. I mean, there's a lot of people that have longevity here. And if we were miserable in that environment, we wouldn't stay, right? Um, so I think it's really that, that caring attitude and that value that makes us want to stay, want to be engaged and want to continue.